ladies' night. My moto mamas. The girls' weekly rip round Victoria. Biker paradise. Oh man, it's therapy. The Moto Mamas formed three years ago. A loose knit group of South Island gals, 150 strong and growing. Oh, it's a blast. Their rides as diverse as the women themselves. CTX 700, Maxi Scooter, Soft Tail Deluxe, Honda CBR. 600 RR super sport bike. <laughs> Cheryl's a wrencher and Harley enthusiast. Angela loves racing. Maceo, a university professor. I really like the independence. Something I can do for me. I think it's the adventure. The feeling of freedom that you get. It's a way of completely clearing your head. Our passion drawing us closer together. Most of these people are people I would never have met in any other circumstance in my life. A growing group. The U.S. Motorcycle Industry Council says that one in four riders are female. The number of female riders increasing by 35% over the last 10 years. The course I'm teaching right now, we have seven women, three men. So, yeah, I'm seeing a lot more women coming into, the, into riding, and it's great. Surprisingly, many first-time women riders are in their 40s and 50s. 50 years ago, 60 years ago, we were housewives. Now we're everything. Today, women are searching for the same thing men are, adventure. I'm nothing like my granny. I'm young. I've still got a lot of adventure left in me. We're buying more bikes, too. The council says American women bought 12% of the bikes sold in 2014. Unfortunately, the industry, it seems, is just beginning to take notice. It is really tough finding bikes that uh, fit short people. Women's safety gear is slowly improving. It's fitting better, and there's more selection. There should be. Women tend to be very safety conscious. It's constantly thinking like a mom in some respect. So you want to do it right. Across the country, more clubs like Moto Mamas are forming, creating communities of like-minded riders seeking the same thrill men do. I don't see any difference. Women riding simply to enjoy the freedom two wheels bring. So guys, if your gal's a Moto Mama, forget the flowers. Give them farkles instead. In Victoria, I'm Dar Duncan.